Both legal men are in the ring and set to start things off here. We're ready to go. And this is one of those matches where it's hard to believe we get paid for this. Well, actually, it's hard to believe Saxton gets Ouch. paid for anything. I don't know where Styles gets his burst, but you think he's down and out, but then out of nowhere, he can hit you with a flurry of strikes. And then AJ may just be one Styles clash away from victory. No one's backing down here. What an impasse. What grace flowed over into the DDT. Spiked him. Jericho is on a mission. No matter what time of year it is, Y2J wants to give everyone the gift of Jericho and just have them drink it in. What a strike. In the corner, stop it away. Chris Jericho is certainly a future WWE Hall of Famer but it's often a self-adoring, narcissistic attitude that leads the WWE Universe and many in the locker room to just be disgusted by his behavior. Look, Chris Jericho is one of the greatest superstars to ever walk through that curtain. The man's beaming with confidence and conviction. And you know what? Chris Jericho has every right to. Drink it in is right. Yeah, drink the Kool-Aid, Corey. He's not looking like himself here. But it's going to take a lot more than that to stop him here tonight. You never want to count a competitor out, but things don't seem to be going in his favor here tonight. Oh, most of the truly great tag teams in sports entertainment created a double team finishing maneuver. The spike pile driver from Anderson and Blanchard, the heart attack from the Heart Foundation, the rocker dropper from the Rockers, or the doomsday device from the Road Warriors. The team needs to have a tag team finisher and be able to execute that finisher on all types of opponents. Uh-oh, here we go, here we go! Corey, a few moments ago, you mentioned some of the great tag team finishing moves in sports entertainment history. Don't forget about the 3D from the Dudley Boys or the double drop kick from the 2017 WWE Hall of Famers, the Rock and Roll. And he escapes the submission. And good thing, that could have been disastrous. Look at the slam with authority. Oh, oh man! AJ Styles looking a little out of his element. You don't see that very often. In a tag team contest, a superstar and partner lock up against another duo. Unless there's a special stipulation added to the match, the traditional rules of a singles match apply in terms of winning the match via pinfall, submission, countout, or disqualification. He's getting after it while he has the energy. Smart move. Uh -oh, here comes the phenomenal one. In a standard tag team match, one competitor is in the ring against an opponent, and their teammate is in their corner standing on the ring apron. I should also point out that the competitor in the ring, as far as the referee is concerned, is the legal man. Only the legal man can attempt to score a fall over an opponent, or be defeated by an opponent. In a tag match, when a superstar tags their partner, the person who tagged out has until the referee's count of five to exit the ring. For a tag to be considered legal, both of the superstar's feet have to be on the apron. The partner must be touching the tag rope in the corner. 
Both great job escaping, trying to turn this thing around. Over the last few years, the tag team scene in WWE is hotter than it's ever been. One of the teams that has shined brighter than any other is the New Day. Xavier Woods, Big E, and Kobe Kingston are two-time tag team champions. But it was their second reign that put the New Day name in WWE history books forever. The tag team competition right now is as heated as it's ever been since the Attitude Era. Everywhere you look, there's another tremendous tag team combination looking to make a run at the WWE Tag Team Gold. When we talk about the New Day, the team won a fatal four-way match in their second tag team title reign at 2015's SummerSlam. I may think the power of positivity stinks like a bag of rotting garbage. And that Woods, Kingston, and Big E are idiots. And he tags his partner in. Momentum has certainly shifted here, Michael. He's making a statement here with this attack. Picture perfect drop kick. Also by Joel Schultz. Hook hits you. Close line. Good grief. He's starting to feel it here. And he wrapped to his suit. AJ cover. Styles makes the cover. Gets to the ropes, forcing the break. And Michael, I have to question the decision to go for a submission so close to the ropes. When AJ starts this stuff, I kind of lose interest. Back in the ring now. Will it hinder your modeling career? He's in trouble. He's looking at oh, Man, the damage has been done. He's going for the pin. Digging deep for a kick out. Not yet. What a stop. Good grief. For many years, members of the WWE Universe and the WWE locker room have felt that tag team matches should have two referees. Oh, and he makes the tag. That was a game changer right there, Michael. Oh, my goodness. This hurts. He's got the shoulders down. And I can't believe this match is still going on. Too soon. Byron, earlier you raised a point that people have been talking about for years, and that's a second referee being appointed to tag team matches. I remember WWE Hall of Famer and former WWE President Gorilla Monsoon used to express his strong advocacy for two referees being appointed to tag team matches. Uh, it's something that's been talked about for decades, Michael, and I don't think it's ever going to happen. We've seen it on occasion, but I think it's best to let the superstars be responsible for themselves. And the appointed official for the match needs to do the job they're paid to do. I don't think it's that much to ask. That drop kick in the corner. Perfectly executed. The owner of literally dozens of championships. There is nothing Chris Jericho hasn't done here in WWE. To put it bluntly, the man is an absolute legend. Here comes Chris Jericho. Is he done? AJ Styles is impressed with himself right now, but he better watch it. Hard to argue Byron's assessment of Jericho's. Wow, he got out of it. Yeah, I'm not so sure he had it fully locked in. This is what makes him one of the best going to the cover. Kicks out on the pinfall attempt. Not yet. This might be it. Oh, my. He's in a little bit of trouble now. Victory is on the horizon. There have been times that he's got him covered. This one's not over yet. Uh-uh. Come on, baby! He might have an impact, but he's got to capitalize now. He leaves no doubt right there. Down he goes. That'll do it every time. Here's Chris Jericho. Oh, nasty impact. From a full impact. Got every ounce of that one. This could be over. Chris Jericho is rolling forward. Back between the ropes. Backbreaker flawlessly executed. He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. Y2J being outclassed right now. 
He may very well be on Dream Street right now, guys. This has been one of the most intense back and forth battles I've seen in a long time. And unfortunately for him, it's not looking so great right now. They can't walk after that attack to the back. When this guy's on, look out. Wow, I thought he was a goner. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Harsh impact. Oh, <laughs> uh, I think this is the beginning of just some great execution right there. He's getting after it while he has the energy. Smart move. You gotta believe this one's over. by AJ Styles. Nailed it. Full impact. Oh my goodness. There's the... He's not going to like this. Uh-oh, AJ Styles may have it. Oh, my goodness! The driver spiked him to think. I almost wrote him off earlier. We got a real quick. Oh. He's looking at it. AJ's in big trouble now. So incredibly devastating. Bringing it back into the ring. The tag team scene here in WWE is undergoing a bit of a renaissance, and it's because of action like this. Chris Jericho is tagged in. Oh, it's not gonna be good. This is not gonna be good. Oh, man, that hurt. Counter here. Oh, my goodness. Hooked up. Oh, shit breaker. Looking for the finish. Ooh, oh, right there. That was nasty. Let's look at the replay. Nice move right there. The cover. One. Oh, ouch. Oh, man. What a strike. Oh, close line. And that one drops him. Somebody's on a mission tonight. Here, harsh impact. That's a good way to find yourself up. Look at that. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Oh, and he's taken off his feet. I'll tell you, he can't afford to be horizontal at this point in the match, Cole. Oh, nasty impact. Reverses that one. Oh, tear the features clean off your face. He can't take much more. Ooh, what impact. That's a good way to find yourself on the list of Jericho. His shoulders are down. Two. Two. This guy just refuses to quit. There is no quit in this man tonight. Uh-oh. Turn it on in a hurry. Oh, drop kick to the back. Too quick for.
for him there. Oh, and he reverses it. And he's taken down with authority. I think I felt the ground shake on that one. He's going for it all. Look at this! What a hellaciously physical match these gladiators have put themselves through. The intensity of this has been incredible. He has him right where he wants him. And one more time. Boom. Man, that's a good way to find yourself on the list of Jericho. He may get the three count right there. Two. Lock Jack. Face first. He knows he's in trouble. He's almost got him. Crucifix, shoulders on the mat. One, two. Going for it. Trying to step through. Roll on their belly. He's got it. Walls of Jericho locked in. But can he follow up here? A win like that says a lot about a duo. I can't remember a tag team match in recent memory that was even close to as good as that one was. Hope everybody at home set those DVRs because that was a match you're going to want to watch again and again and again. Epic. That was just one of those matches that the men involved should just be proud to be a part of. A legendary performance. Here are your winners. The phenomenal AJ Styles and Chris Jericho. Another exciting tag team match in the books. I can honestly say that a win is a little more satisfying when you make your opponent tap out. I couldn't agree more. What an amazing contest that was.